Hello and welcome to the Rookie Mazda at Laguna Seca WeatherTech Raceway. Uh, we are back in the Rookie Mazda. It's been a nice handful of months before I've uploaded one of these. I usually don't upload these because they go to the same track. <gasps> Excuse me. Tracks over and over again. And uh, it just gets repetitive. But I figure it's been a while and uh, I was going to upload... And maybe I still will, I don't know, I haven't decided as of this recording, a uh, production car challenge, but it was absolutely atrocious, um, in case I didn't upload it, still, like I said, still undecided, um, pretty much coming to the start-finish line, guys ran into each other and caused a huge wreck that I couldn't avoid, and destroyed my car and had to tow before we even got to the start finish line and I tried to make it a little farther but realized that my wheel damage or whatever was too severe and therefore I had to tow after pulling it off the track so I ended up with 5x before getting to the start finish line essentially and uh, that's really pathetic <laughs> And then, of course, the rest of the race, I just rode around, laps down, uh, never even had an off-track after that, so... Ooh, speaking of off-track, almost got it there through the quartz screw. Kinda cut it wrong there. But, I really wanted to do a good Mazda race here. I really wanted to do a Mazda race. And uh, the production car challenge did not really scratch that itch for me, so I okay, do, I guess. Just keep it session optimal, whatever. Not sure what my speed's gonna be here, but usually feel pretty good in the Mazda. Had some real fast people in the open practice beforehand, and. I didn't actually look at the uh, entry list, but I'm sure they're probably in here. I go so timid through there that time. I feel like I just I'm not in the rhythm today. Got lack of sleep or something. <laughs> but we'll see what we can. Pull off, I guess. That production car challenge was just such a bummer, though, because I was really looking forward to it. It had been a while since I did a production car challenge, and I didn't even get to do one lap cleanly. And that was just killer. So, I'm hoping this goes better, and hey, I'll upload a uh, rookie monster race for once. Maybe someone will find it helpful. If I'm actually even actually okay at this, that remains to be seen. I feel like I'm usually pretty decent here. I like Laguna Seca. I've grown pretty comfortable with the Mazda car. P3. 38.9, I can do better than that. I am not entirely... Satisfied. Say one three eight nine. So we'll try to improve this lap. Tires getting warmed up. It's gonna be a big deal, of course. Anyway, so should be gaining time. How much time? We will find out. Everyone talks about the corkscrew. I think this is the scariest turn on the track. <laughs> you have to hit it pr so precisely to get it just right, and if you mess it up, then probably not doing too good. 
Good corkscrew, I think. I'm happy with that. I keep saying I'm happy with that. I'm not happy with that. That was a horrible corner. I don't know why it didn't turn. I feel like it probably turns a little bit better than that. There. I like to shift a second there, even though it's like right on the limit. Because it feels like it helps me turn in. And I'm pretty bad at the final corner. That's always been a thing, but... Uh, let's see, 138.2, I'll take that. Whoa, Satoshi's fast! Sense he's the number one. 137.7, that's pretty solid. Maybe we'll be able to keep up with him if we keep in his draft. Four tenths to the next guy behind, but I'm sure we still got people doing their second lap. Which, like I said, should be faster for just about everyone, because the tires are up to temp more. But hopefully it'll be a fun race. I hope it goes better than the uh, production car challenge, at least. Got to remember not to go too hard on the opening laps, as the uh, tires are cold. Oh my gosh, Satoshi hit an even faster lap. 137.2. Dang. Calm down, man. You already had the pole. <laughs> I'm wondering if anyone's gonna overtake me then as they do their second lap. Feeling just a little bit off rhythm today. I feel like normally I've got a better handle on this, but. Alright, there's another spot we have dropped. That's okay. At least that one's not a full second faster. We're pretty close to Fabio there, the number three. This is top split, had about 180 people sign up. Always really good participation in the rookie mosses. That's another reason I run it so much. Just usually don't record, but I run it so much is because pretty much any time of day, even the ungodly hours that I race, you can find some people on here. Now we're dropping now. It's to P4. So we got about three people right there that are about similar pace between me, Fabio, and Juan. And that's Satoshi's probably going to drive away. <laughs> And uh, we'll see oof, what the guys behind have. They're not too crazy far off. Fifth and sixth probably can hold on. And then you never know if someone just had a rough qualifying too. All right. P4 in the end, I'll take it. I just want to finish the race, man. After that brutal production car challenge. Just get me to the end of this one. This one a nice run. Cleanse my palate of that disgusting last race. <laughs> but just in case it goes south, I'll have all that ready. Maybe we can learn something from Satoshi up there, Jesus. Now you'll notice like my all-time best is of 136. That's because I ran this in an open setup. That is not gonna be possible at all with the fixed uh, rookie setup, which is meant to be more stable for rookies, obviously. So, you'll see like uh, 136.6 is my all time best there, but even Satoshi there had a 137.2, and then 138.2 is about as good as I could hope. I think the best I got in the practice beforehand was a 137.9. So about a second off, a little over a second off of uh, my all-time best on this setup. The track temp is 81. All right, get ready to go. Right. P4. Okay, Colton, get ready. Green, 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 green. Ten to go this time by. Okay, got a bit of a run already in front of us. Hmm. 
Car on your left. Still there, hold your line. Do you know where people are? Keep to the right. Felt like that guy was clear on the left. Pressuring me a little bit there. Car on your left. Clear on the left. <laughs> All right. A little weird. I got myself in a weird spot there. I wasn't entirely sure where he was exactly. But we should catch up with the draft here to the top four. Driving a little bit timidly on the cold tires. It's probably what I should be doing. Less grip right now. I'm gonna drive a little bit slow through here. Ooh. I've been close to a couple off tracks, but haven't quite in, quite uh, gotten off yet. And it looks like we're back caught up, so I'm going to do session optimal now, since all-time optimal isn't quite accurate for what I can run. I'm on the gas a little early. Didn't hurt too much. Oh, turn, please, car. It is so stiff early on. Try not to get myself off tracks. I think these three guys ahead of me are faster. I'm kind of barely holding on. Thanks to draft and uh, to getting the right sides off of there. Obviously not going to attempt to pass into the corkscrew. I don't plan on dying today. No death wish for me, thank you. We will go ahead and follow him through. We didn't have enough of a run anyway, but even if I did, was not gonna be messing with that. Wasn't too bad of a final corner. I'm usually pretty bad at that corner. So I'll take that. Satoshi doing his best to drive away, but draft is always going to be a problem. We'll drive it a little bit. Could have been worse. Got a little bit of space behind us, that's nice. And the tires are starting to warm up, so the lap time should come down a little bit. Hopefully. They might just uh, still drive away from me ahead, though. Uh, Nest my mark a little there. I like to take that a little bit closer to the apex. Imagine that. Hitting the apex is a good way to drive. Draft is making it hard to find my braking points because I'm entering so much faster than I normally would. I'm trying to brake early, but right there I needed to brake even earlier. Ugh. Inconsistent all of a sudden. That wasn't great. Yeah, these guys ahead of me are better. So we got about P4 speed here today, I think. They could battle, they could run into each other, don't know what could happen quite yet. So obviously I'm going to keep going for it.
Draft really helping me out, helping me pull away from the guys behind, too. Satoshi driving away, as might have been expected, given his crazy qualifying lap. He's very fast. Oh, they're running into each other. Second and third. Sorry, I'm sorry. Apologizes. It's clearly an accident. That's what I'm saying, though. Don't worry. Never know what could happen here. Already going much better than the production car challenge, though, because I'm actually racing still. Imagine that. I don't even think I would want to battle these guys if I got up next to them. That might be the best position for me right here, right now. What I've got going on. Letting the, them battle each other. As long as I'm not losing, losing time to the guy behind. I think I'm kind of happy with where I am. Man, he keeps running into the back of him. Three again into the back of the five. I almost get in the back of him there because he parks it. Way off pace there. He messed up that corner. Please back out. Clear on the right. Nice one, Colter. Great move. Keep it up. He doesn't have to back out, so we're both gonna lose time. So thank you to him for that. Wide back there. So uh, we've seen him run into the back of the five. Is he gonna start running into the back of me now? Guess we're gonna find out. Five laps to go. Time to go. Hang on, quick. Can we hold them off? Can we get a podium? That was kind of a gross corner. I don't think I did that very well. Eh, maybe it was okay. Alright. Kind of use a tiny bit of break there to kind of pitch it through that corner. It seems to work pretty well. Time to get defensive, mate. Best corkscrew there. I think I overthought it. <laughs> And he's wrecking. Right side. Clear. I don't know what happened to be honest. Push, 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 or we'll lose this place. I think I was able to avoid him. I might I think I might have gotten to the back of him, I'm not sure. You're in second position right there now. There could have been some internet related issues going on there too that led to that happening the way it did. Well, left side, clear, left side. Keep to the right. Stay on the right, clear. Right side. Keep to the left. 
Clear. Car right. Clear on the right. Left side. Stay on the right. Keep to the right. Clear. Dang. Left side. Well, we've let the uh, four catch up after all that nonsense. Satoshi's on his merry way up there. Just having a Sunday drive. My pedals just slipped out from under me a little bit. That was scary. So we've uh, lost one of the drivers. Focus on the exits. And Your gained a Lars book. Your last lap time was at Good name. Ah, I keep overdriving it. I think I need to consider the tires. I think the tires might be a little sore <laughs> at this point in the race. Probably need to drive it a little softer now. Dude, what the fuck was that? Uh oh, someone got taken out, I assume. So we got 2x from that interaction. Sure, like I said, I'm not exactly sure how that went down. I tried my best to avoid him. It looked like he was going to slide to the right, and so I went left, and then he was kind of like, he stayed left a little bit. Ooh, messed up the hairpin in front of us. Or not the hairpin, but corkscrew. Am I talking about hairpin? I mean, you gotta warn me if you're trying to bleed off an off track. I'm sorry, I just I had no idea you were gonna break so early. Well, that sucks. What the fuck are you guys doing? Oh, this is falling apart. That sucks. So I'm assuming it was not, I said off track, but a cut, a corner cut, is what I assume happened there. And he was, he had a penalty, he was having to bleed off, and I didn't know it. Use all the track, force them to find the gap. Ugh. Man, I felt like we were having a great race, and then it's gotten pretty messy. It sucks. Greg, you realize you can't just rejoin the track when there's cars in there. I feel like we had like a really good battle brewing there, and now it's just all gone. Now I'm lonely. What flag? What I flag? Wonder if there's anything I could have done, man. I'm. It's not gonna get very lonely if I do that. Jesus, about to throw it away, thinking about all of my regrets. Last lap, bring it on home. Your lap time was 139.35. Left side. Let's dive. Clear on the left. Left side. Yeah, he keeps it down there. Keep to the right. Keep to the right. Clear. Not as clean a race as I would like, though. 
I wish that gone had gone better. I'm stinking it up too. This guy behind deserves a spot more than I do. I'm garbage right now. a little bit better in the corkscrew I think he's not quite up to speed through there and I think that's gonna be the difference terrible final corner but it doesn't matter good win number one on the left <sighs> well done, Colton. Great drive. That's a There's podium. I'll have to look at those over. incidents. Nice run. Solid work. <sighs> Not exactly sure how or what to think quite yet. First one, I tried my best to avoid him. Second one, he's just... Uh, I think he was trying to reduce a penalty like he got a cut corner through the uh, corkscrew or something <sighs> that stinks we'll take a look so many of you can't report it. apparently it was a messy race behind us too what what? <laughs> that guy was in reverse to start the race. Classic Red Bull racing, I guess. What on earth? <laughs> How do you make that mistake? And it's like he wasn't even paying attention either. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Yeah, it was a good race with Lars, though. So. We'll see it eventually after we watch the guy reverse. Top split, by the way. Like, I know this is rookie. But this is top split. These are, like, supposedly higher rated guys. Here's another shifting issue, because they go and shift it into first gear, I guess, or reverse or something, and blow their engine right in front of a bunch of guys. Satoshi being a, a legend, I guess. Look at, look at that optimization. <laughs> He's like, perfect. That's amazing. So here's... Uh, the three getting to the back, and the five, I believe that's the first time it happened. And lap five, already halfway through this thing. We had a defensive line entering the corner. I don't see anything going on there. Some serious defense from P2, and then just runs in the back of him again. That was the second time. Doing a chat, there's Red Bull going off. Shoot. Dang. Is he still here? 
Man. That sucks. I'm, I really tried to avoid him. See, from my point of view, I see him spinning, and I'm like, okay, okay, he's gonna be going to the right, and I kind of went right, and then left, and it was just indecisive, and then, ugh. Dang. That sucks. I mean, he, he got sideways in the first place, of course, but I tried my best to avoid him, and I failed, so that really stinks. Hmm. Not a not as clean as a race I would like. Kind of got all unsettled there. Oh my God! They missed a breaking point. Holy cow! Absolutely nuking him. They feel bad about it. It looks like they're gonna try to let him by. Yeah, they're gonna swing from. Oh my gosh. So after uh, having been spun, I guess he comes in. Three wasn't your fault. <sighs> do do do. Okay, this is after it happened. Let's see. Go back. Number three. So he's saying that uh, this one wasn't. Because I think, yeah, when you went through. Oh, he's gone. I'm going to send it anyway. <sighs> that was nice of him. To give a, uh, a viewpoint there. So yeah, that's what happened, I think. I think the three cut right here, and so he's got a penalty he needs to bleed off. And he wait he was waiting to do it. I just didn't see it coming. And he's doing it in the racing line. Like if you're gonna bleed it off, I think you gotta like pull over to the side. Yeah, I just I didn't see it coming. It sucks, it really does. Dang, man. I hate that, though, because I feel like I could have made it through this thing. Zero X. And instead I got got into two guys. Let me look at the other one. Oops. Yeah, okay. So we're coming around. So he gets his left sides in the sand. That's what to get him. Get some sideways. And then... I just, I was indecisive. I had no idea where I was going to be. I thought maybe he would hold it. I had no idea. I'll just be honest. I had no idea where he was going. I thought maybe he'd spin to the right. And then it started look, look, looking like he was going to save it. And so I thought, okay, he's going to pull to the left so I could pull it down over here. But then it looked like he was staying straight. And I'm like, I got to left. And I just, I hit the brakes. I, and I just barely got into the back of him. hate that, but oh well. And then, uh, that's where that guy gets sent. That's where this incident happened. It's 
kind of just backing up right into traffic. So he's not <laughs> probably not the best way to handle that either. I know he wants to get going fast as possible, but you can't do that. You can't reverse right onto the racing surface like that. So that wasn't very good. Uh, I set off that chain of events though. Well, I mean, technically he did, but I was part of that chain of events. I mean, frustration from the f number five, I guess, after it was over. Man. Uh, so, I'm not primary blame for any of the incidents, but like secondary or tertiary blame, <laughs> I think is a good way of putting it. So we get P2, but I'm not necessarily thrilled with how it went. Satoshi should be. He dominated. He got... Oh, he got 1x. I was going to say he probably got a 0x too, but must have had an off track at some point. I guess... Uh, I guess compared to everyone else, I was pretty clean after we look at the incidents, but I don't know. That'll do it, though. Um, some rookie Mazdas. It's been a minute. Uh, pull it into P2, Silver Battle. Nothing for Satoshi once he got out of the draft. Um, impressive run from him. And uh, not the cleanest race, but not the worst either. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.